Our next story is about a tiny device that may help with a big problem in hockey. As you know, concussions are sidelining many players, including Sidney Crosby. As Cameron McIntosh discovered, a minor league team in Saskatoon is testing a new gadget that's giving it a heads up on who's at risk of a serious head injury. Each time they step on the ice, the Saskatoon Renegades midget double-A team plays to win. That means hitting and being hit, which for Den and Kidd has also meant a concussion. It was in the danger zone in the boards, and uh, yeah, just got a little bump. Shouldn't have felt, you know, anything, but for some reason, yeah, a major headache came on. Just like the National Hockey League, concussions are also a growing concern in amateur hockey. In fact, at this level, there's innovation at play with new detection technology. The Renegades are testing a technology called SafeBrain, a toonie-sized motion sensor that fixes on the back of a helmet. Well, these are actually activated right now, so when they get hit... Yeah, it's going. Yeah. Cool. Light flashes. Yeah, light flashes. And that gives the coaching staff a visual indicator when this player comes back to the bench that they should maybe evaluate him and see if he's uh, suffering injury. In this game, it doesn't take long. Check out that bump along the boards. It doesn't look like much, but it fires the sensor. Turns out it's Den and Kid. Yep, let me see your eyes. What I then do is I just look at the look at the player, look him in the eyes, make sure that he's coherent, his uh, pupils aren't dilated. He doesn't show symptoms and plays on, but what the sensors also do is record the time, direction, and g-force of each hit, information most NHL doctors don't have. We can see here this was a particular hit. Uh, Concussion specialist Martin Morazic is analyzing the data from each hit on each sensor and says it's providing insight on which hits are the worst. There seems to be this acceleration and rotational component that's most problematic. That infamous one on Sidney Crosby is a good example, but it's the less obvious hits that have Saskatoon minor hockey worried. Each player is also being tested to see if a season's worth of hits add up to any cognitive losses. A lot of times it could be an open ice bump or something like that where the head is still moving, and maybe we need to know that those are causing issues as well. At $3,000 to outfit a team, it's not a cheap way to get answers, but teams are lining up. SafeBrain can't produce sensors fast enough for all the teams that want them. Cameron McIntosh, CBC News, Saskatoon.